well good morning it's Friday and I'm so glad you've joined us we've got some one we've got a wonderful couple of verses to look at this morning that I trust will do you good so welcome from me Goff. welcome to the book of Habakkuk let's pray ask the Holy Spirit to come and help us Lord thank you that we have this opportunity to start our day like this with you to, to gain heaven's perspective that changes us and takes us into the day different men and women so come holy spirit i pray speak to us today through your word in jesus name i ask it amen well we've come to the end i think we're going to finish today we we've been on this journey with habakkuk how long oh god what's going on in the nations god's reply Look at the nations and watch, be amazed. You won't believe what I'm going to do. And then, got, then Habakkuk taking the, the precious stones, the little gems out of his pocket, those truths, God, you're eternal, you're everlasting, you're my rock, you're mine. You're, uh, and uh, then he, 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 goes, he said, I'm going to go on my watchtower. I'm not going to live in all the questions and the confusion. I'm, I've, I've prayed, now I'm looking for you. And then this wonderful prayer that we've that we've seen we've been looking at this week praying for revival in our time lord i've stand in awe of your deeds i've heard of your fame repeat them in our day and of course that infl that involves looking back god you did this you're the god of creation the god of the sunrise we saw you're the god of the exodus you're the, you're the, the sun and the moon stand still you're the god of the cosmos you're our god come and um uh, magnificent sense of the glory of God the theophany God coming close his presence as oh please Lord do that in our day his mighty acts and then we see verse 16 I heard and my heart pounded oh God come Lord my lips quivered at the sound decay crept in my bones <laughs> oh God I was I was crumbling my legs trembled Yet I wait patiently for the day of calamity. I know the day of judgment is coming to come on the nation, to come on the nations invading us. He knew that the judgment was coming to the people of Israel. God was going to sift them uh, for his purposes. And then listen to this. Though the fig tree doesn't, I have to say it the way I know it, doesn't blossom. And there are no grapes on the vine. Though the olive crop fails and the fields produce no fruit, though there's no sheep in the, in the sheepfold, no cattle in the stall, yet will I rejoice in the Lord. Now, what's going on here? It's about the gift of joy. It's about the gift, we spoke the other week about the gift of peace when I was preaching. The gift of joy. You see, as you know, the joy of the Lord is our strength. It's so, it's so important. Joy is so important, especially in difficult days. Habakkuk is still in the, whoa, what's going on? The circumstances around him have not changed, but he's changed. He's got a glimpse of who God is, and he's changed. He's got that sense of, oh, God, you're awesome. He's He's been humbled. He's got, a, oh, God, give us a bigger sense of your glory. He's changed. And he's got this, and, and, and when he's in catching glimpse of, glimpse of the glory of God, the joy of the Lord has, has begun to flood his soul. This is the walk of faith. Nothing's changed on the outside, but everything's changed on the inside because he's got a, he's got a, a sense of the closeness of the Lord. So let's go through this. Um, the, the, the fig tree doesn't blossom. Now, okay, we start with fairly small things. By the way, Angie told me once that fig trees don't blossom. I don't know about that. Anyway, so in other words, although there's no figs, now figs were a, a luxury, okay? So we start off with the luxuries, you know, a nice fig. Hmm. Um, it's not exactly staple diet. But that, so, okay, the luxuries are gone. Um, then the next thing, oh, crumbs is stepping up. No grapes on the vine. Oh, no wine or... Uh, or, you know, it, that's going to be better, but that's getting a bit more serious. Um, it gets even. Then the next one, though the olive crop fails, olive oil, 
cooking, what is it going, bread and stuff? I don't know, but olive oil, is getting, in other words, it's getting incrementally more difficult. Do you see that? Though the fields produce no food. Whoa, it's really getting serious now. Okay, he's kind of, he's growing in his faith. <laughs> Do you see? He's growing in his faith. You know, Lord, yeah, luxuries, oh, it's okay, but it's all right, Lord. No wine, well, yeah, I'm going to keep trusting. Uh, no olive oil, oh, God. We've now got... No, 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 the fields produce no food. Now, listen, though there's no sheep in the sheepfold. Oh boy, this is getting really serious now. It's not just food and sustenance, it's clothes to keep you warm. It's, it's, it's real recession going on now, isn't it? Though there's no sheep in the, the sheepfold and no cattle in the stall. Good gracious, there's no, there's no milk. There's no, the, this is really, really serious. It's, it's grown yet will i rejoice in the lord i will re i will be joyful I'll re in the in in god my savior <laughs> this is the walk of faith this is wonderful this is a man who's growing in faith he's step by step god i can i'm trusting you in this I'm trusting you that, oh God, yeah, I'm going to keep rejoicing. I'm not going to become a misery guts. I'm not going to join in the misery chorus that's going on around me in the recession. I'm going to trust in you because I believe that you are my Father God and you will provide for me. Isn't that beautiful? Um, how's time going? Oh, I'm going to run out here, aren't I? The Sovereign Lord is my strength. The Sovereign, there it is, Sovereign. He's in control. The Sovereign Lord is my strength. He makes my feet like the feet of a deer. Goodness me, there's hopping and skipping and jumping going on here. Um, th this is really beautiful. He enables me to tread on the heights. He lifts me up. Isn't that lovely? Dear friends, this is the walk of faith. This is what the Lord is calling us to to the joy of the Lord. And it'd be so easy in these days to become fearful people and to become griping people. And we're called to be a testimony by being the opposite, by being people at peace and the people of joy. What a testimony if you and I walk through the day like that. What a, what a testimony to the Lord who we love and live for, if we can live like that, okay? Um, it's beautiful. It, it really is. The fig tree doesn't... Oh, it's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful song, psalm that we often sing. And let it be the truth of our lives. Um, as we go into today, let there be a song in your heart. Yet, I, it, it, it's, a, it's a kind of a declaration of the will isn't it verse 18 i will rejoice in the lord i will be joyful in god my savior the sovereign lord is my strength and he makes my feet like the feet of a of a deer <laughs> isn't it? this is beautiful this is our savior i will be joyful in god my savior lord I thank you so much that you are our saviour. Lord, we, we needed a saviour. You came and you, you saved us. You drew us out. You made us your own. You cleansed us. You, you forgave us. You changed us. And you gave us a hope and a future in a world that's in confusion. And Lord, we pray that we wouldn't be gripers and moaners. But we'd be worshippers those that love you, who walk with you and live differently as a result. Lord, go with us today, I pray. Give us a song. Lord, I know there's probably difficult things going on in some of our lives, but Lord, by your grace, may there be a song. But may there be joy in our hearts, even though some of those things might be happening, some of those hardships might be real for us that we've just read about. Yet will we rejoice in you and trust in you go with us today i pray in jesus name amen well god bless we come to the end of habakkuk we're going to be starting an advent series on the 
1st of December and I, I'm just, well, meanwhile I'll be back on Monday uh, for just, uh, just three, as it were, one-off um, morning devotions before we start our Advent series on the 1st of December. God bless, have a great day, see you on Monday. Bye now.